What up peeps? Welcome back to my channel. If this is your first time here, thanks so much for joining me. I would love it if you took the time to subscribe to my channel and hit that notification bell so you're notified anytime I upload a video. In today's video, I'm going to show you how I made this super simple fall themed uh, rustic farmhouse-ish tray. <laughs> it was super easy, so I will show you guys what I used to make it. You're literally only gonna need three materials. So I have this nautical rope, this orange placemat, and also some foam board, and I just had pieces laying around. You will probably need either one or two pieces. As you can see, I cut it already to be the size of the mat, and again, I had just pieces laying around, so I improvised and cut some to the size, and all I did was hot glue both of those pieces together so it made a thick tray base for me. I didn't want to do just one piece because it would be too flimsy so again I stacked it and then I went ahead and put some hot glue all around the center and then if you can see there's a flat part and a part that sticks up on the mat so I laid the flat part to be the on the top <laughs> if that makes sense so the part that sticks out is going towards the bottom and then once I stuck that right on the center I just took my hot glue and then started gluing all around the edges as well. My next step was to glue my nautical rope around and you guys can do it in any method that you find easier but for me I just went ahead and took that hot glue and put it right around the top edge of the mat and then started gluing my rope down and I did several layers of it and I found it that it was going to be a lot easier for me if I did this first layer of rope right at the top and then I would do the sides um, but for this part right here I'm just going to go ahead like I said before just do several layers of rope um, after that first one and towards the center. And right here I'm just going to start hot gluing the rope on the edges, on the outer edges of the tray. Now I'm going to glue another layer of rope on top of that first layer and I accidentally used the shorter piece of rope so I had to unglue it and then glue the right one on there. Again I just went all the way around and I took two pieces of rope and cut them to size to make two handles for each end. Uh, before I glue that I'm going to go ahead and finish the rest of this so I'm just wrapping, wrapping, wrapping. Alright, so you guys can see this is the second piece of rope on that second layer of the mat. And then I'm just going to take my handles and hot glue them right in between the first piece of rope and then the second piece of rope. So I'm just going to hot glue all the way around and put my rope down all the way around and <laughs> over the handles. All right, you guys, so that is a final step and you're done. It is super easy and inexpensive. I don't remember if I used two ropes or three. Either way, you're gonna end up paying like four or five dollars tops on this. And look how pretty it looks. I think it'll be perfect for your fall harvest or Thanksgiving decor. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you give me a thumbs up. Also, don't forget to subscribe if you'd be so kind. Leave any comments down below and I will see you guys on the next one. Bye. Stay tuned for a second tray.